Hi, glad you can make it. My name's Mark Foster. And I'm Dynamic Dan. <laughs> of course he is. And this is the Mission Magic famous Top of the Props. Ooh, with a new look, I think we're really rocking those afros today. Oh, definitely. Let's start at number 10. In at number 10, it's a classic, the Pom Pom Pole. Connected. Could be the green one, but I think if you pull the green one and that happens, yeah, it's kind of strange. But then if that's the green one, what does the blue one do? I've always wondered. Oh, that does that. So we've got red, blue, ah, oh, yeah, the red one does that. That is the pom-pom pole. And at number nine, we've got the drooping sunflower. It's with a helper, or how about a breath detector to make sure your breath is fresh before the show. Let's see. <gasps> that seems fine to me. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh yeah, I forgot to brush my teeth. But if you At number eight, it's frozen fun with a sponge ice cream. But why have one ice cream when you can have two? These come as a pair, and that means you can do the endless ice cream trick. One and two, you can make as many ice creams as you like. And at number uh, seven, something to tickle your fancy, it's the duster wand. These are great, you can either do them barehanded, so you just wave your hand over the top like that, and then they change like that, you can do them slowly or quickly, or you can use a handkerchief, and we even give you a handkerchief with them, and you just, uh, just give them a little white like that. And then they change. Wow. Boing, boing. Number six is the bounce, no bounce balls. I'm gonna try the world record for the highest bounce. Here we go. Oh, hang on. Um, <clears throat> yeah, well, it rolls, but it doesn't bounce very well. Oh, I remember. You need to wind it up. You need the magic key. Here we go. I know what you're thinking. Is this a wind up? <laughs> a wind up. <laughs> Sorry. Well, let's see if it's worked. Yes, and now well, hey. it bounces. more magic for you as we go into the top five countdown. We actually have a lot of new products as well, some oh, of them yeah. Mission Magic exclusives. So let's get starting with number five which is the the Coke bottle, a trick that won't leave you feeling flat. No time to have a drink, I'm going to show you something with a bottle of Coke. It goes inside a paper bag like this and I'll make it disappear on three. One, two, Three. Look at that, it's completely disappeared. No, no, it's, no? it's in the bag. Oh, uh, I'll bring it back again. Uh, and it's back. I I'm unconvinced. <laughs> no, it's, it's not that convincing, is it? Okay, um, if I was really a magician, then uh, I would just wave my hand over the top. Well, it's gone. Wow. Completely disappeared. And now we're at number four, which is the Cabinet of Wonders. And Dan, this is one of my most favourite ones. But it's a classic of magic. Everybody likes magic boxes, and this is just the right size for your table, but great, but big enough for school assemblies and services and everything. It's an impossible penetration and a real head scratcher, too. Let's see it. It's the ring on key, amazing magic with a borrowed ring and a metal key. Can they get the ring off? No, they can't, but you can because you know the secret. And what we love about this trick is the prop is a really nicely made prop. Great quality, and they need Herculean strength to get that ring off. Or, to so know the secret, you don't have Herculean strength. No, no, no. Ah, don't worry, I found it put it in a safe place. Not in a safe, but on a key, like that. It's, uh, see, it's well and truly on there. There's no way it's gonna come off. Um, is, is that all right, do you mind, uh, on, the, on the key? Oh yeah, you can wear it like that. See, that's, uh, yeah, that's quite subtle. You'll, you'll, you'll get used to it. Um, okay, maybe, do you want it off the, off the key? Oh, I'm in trouble now. Okay, uh, oh, I think it's, it's on too tight. I don't know how it's going to, let's see if I can just, ah, there we go. How's that? There you go. And we're back in at number two, we've got 
got, got your, your number. number. And the key thing to this is to find a member of the audience or a grown up who can add up properly, unlike yeah. some people. Just watch the video demo to, to, <laughs> to get what that means. Thank you, Mark. So, lots of different numbers. Some are yellow, some are red. You can choose which way to put these in this lovely acrylic stand. As I say, great props, really durable. So you can have them facing yellow, facing red. Okay. It's completely up to you. I'm going to look away. Oh, uh, oh dear, Vaudeville. Indeed. Okay. Uh, I think I'll do that one like that. Okay. All done. Finished. Right, 30. 30? It was 30, <laughs> which is the exact number that I wrote there. That's 30. astonishing. Isn't it just 30? <laughs> And at number one, well done. What have we got at number one? We've got Wonders of the World, a great trick that comes with lots and lots of different presentations for Christmas, gospel, all year round, lots of fun. Uh, we went over the top with this one because we love it so much and it's been the best seller in the last couple of months. So let's see Wonders of the World. First of all, I'd like to ask you, where would you like to go on holiday this year? If you could go anywhere, a static caravan in Filey, really? Okay, look, let me give you some ideas. You could go to the Taj Mahal in India. You could go to the Great Wall of China in China. You could go to the pyramids. Or you could go to the Eiffel Tower. Look, I tell you what, let's have a game. I'll, I'll muddle these cards up like this, and I've got a board here. You see, one to, one to two, one to three, one to four, and I'll pop. He's in like this, in random okay, order. So there's the cards. And on the back, if you look, you can see I have a prediction. I think I know what you're going to pick. I'll tell you what, you pick one at random. What's that? Number three. Are you sure? Okay, let's take that out and let's see where you've decided to go. Oh my goodness. It's the Taj Mahal, and I don't mean the restaurant. <gasps> I wonder. I wonder if I predicted you right. Do you think I've been able to? The Taj Mahal. That is an amazing Really? We, we go to the same hairdressers? Yeah, it's funny that, isn't it? It's a small world. See, I went in mm. and uh, like you, I asked for a David Beckham. Yeah. And this is what I got. And I said to her, are you sure this is a David Beckham? And she said, it would be if he came here. <laughs> I said, give me a comb over. She went like this. Unbelievable. I don't know. At number three, it's the Ringo toy. Key on Ring on key, sorry. <laughs> Of the world! <laughs> 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 See, Mark, I've got a problem. I'm afraid my balls have lost their bounce. I can't go that far. No, 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 no. That's, no, that's...